Hello, my name is Iman Shenabu, and I am a senior at Aksa High School in Bidview, Illinois. Hi, I'm Leonardo Rodriguez, a current senior at Victoria Soto High School. Hello, my name is Ramey Samiwala, and I'm a senior at Niles North High School. Hello, I'm Chris Vazry, a senior at Lamont High School, and would like to thank Junior Achievement for being a scholarship finalist. Hi, my name is Abigail Lovell, and I'm a senior at Moments High School. Hello, my name is Sean Abbott, and I am from Lamont High School. Hi, my name is Evelyn Reyes, and I'm from Phoenix Military Academy. Hi, my name is Michael Krause, and I'm a student at Whitney M. Young Magnet High School. Hi, my name is Camila Hajaji. I'm from UXA School. Good afternoon. My name is Angel Lopez. I am a senior at Benito Juarez High School. Every year of my high school career, I have had the privilege to learn, adapt, and hone in on a new skill with Junior Achievement. And with my involvement in Junior Achievement, I have learned valuable leadership skills and communicative skills. While being a senior, I had a tremendous opportunity to be involved in Junior Achievement programs, where I had enjoyable, challenging, and knowledgeable experiences. As a child, I participated in numerous Junior Achievement programs, including the Junior Achievement Our Region program. One thing I've learned and experienced through Junior, Achieve Junior Achievement has been the value of teamwork and conducting market research with my team. Participating in a program like Junior Achievement has allowed me to grow not just as a person, but as a leader. Being able to interview actual leaders in the business field has allowed me to see my strengths and weaknesses and what I could do to enhance them every day. Uh, there's two things that I learned from JA, one being that teaching is hard and I appreciate and admire teachers for it, specifically because COVID has been hard and the remote world is new to everyone. As a member of Junior Achievement, I've learned how much manpower it takes to run a business operation and the dedication required from its members. Junior Achievement has taught me so many life lessons that I hold in my heart today and was such a valuable experience that I am so very blessed to have. One of the biggest life lessons was that it helped me gain confidence in myself in order to strive for a change. Through my experiences with Junior Achievement, I have learned a lot about myself and I am especially grateful for the direction JA has provided me as I enter adulthood. This year, attending the Junior Achievement virtual seminars helped me stay connected with the organization and maintain a level of continual learning despite the pandemic. I participated in the Junior Achievement Company program and my team and I learned that conducting market research to meet a demand in a community is extremely important when bringing a product to life. I'm grateful that Junior Achievement pushed me to my potential and helped me to communicate my thoughts in a professional manner. Junior Achievement also helped me open up other opportunities for other females in my community. Without some of the direction and lessons that JA offered, there's a good chance I would just spend my money carelessly instead of investing it and saving it. Being able to teach financial literacy to younger kids, I feel like that's something that I wish I would have been taught at an earlier age. I learned a lot of techniques that will help me in my future interviews, careers, job applications, and resumes. Some specific skills I've learned are how to create initial capital, how to perfect your product, and how to strategically price your product. For me, coming from a hardworking community where people like me don't often grow and thrive, this means a lot to me because it shows that people are willing to invest in me because they already see the steps I have taken as a leader. For my education, my future education, no plans, I plan on um, becoming a pharmacist. I'm, on an I'm in an accelerated program. My future education plans are all centered around going down a business-related path. So for my undergraduate career, I plan on majoring in marketing at DePaul University with plans to work in the professional world for three to five years, then pursuing my MBA at Northwestern Kellogg. I will be attending the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign in the fall. I decided prior to this experience that I wanted to attend Olivet Nazarene University in Bourbonnet, Illinois and as an elementary education major. Moving on, I plan to continue my education by attending at a four-year college, having a master's degree in nursing, taking philosophy classes, and learning about the human body. I was accepted into the Midwestern Accelerator Pharmacy Program, which is a five-year program, and in the end, I will have my doctorate in pharmacy. I believe these experiences will contribute to my time at uh, the Cranert School of Management at Purdue University, where I will be studying supply chain management, information, 
and analytics. Some of my educational goals is to pursue not just a bachelor's, but a master's degree in both computer science and business administration. I am also working hard in getting an internship with a company. All of this is being done with the sole purpose to one day be able to start my own business, nurture it, and grow it. My educational plans consist of either attending George Washington University or the United States Naval Academy, and then later on pursuing a career in the medical field, specifically in endocrinology or dermatology. My future education plans are to study marketing at the University of Nebraska in Lincoln. Here in America, I have this huge opportunity to get an education and be the change for Yemen. And that is why I am pursuing my dream of becoming a pharmacist and hopefully opening up a pharmacy clinic in Yemen where I'll be able to give back to my community and help them in any way possible. At Junior Achievement, I really enjoyed all the things I learned about marketing through the company program and um, acting as a CMO through the company program. However, I would also like to explore things such as technology management and international business. I viewed the High School Heroes program as a trial run to gauge if I actually loved teaching and working with children as I never had that experience prior. Let's just say I had one of the best experiences of my life. If I were to receive this scholarship, what it would mean to me is that you recognize my um, hard work as a junior achievement student and as a high school student. I would be incredibly grateful to receive any of these scholarships as it will relieve the financial burden on myself, allowing me to pursue degrees beyond my bachelor's and even allow me to study overseas. As a first generation female, I currently have no financial support for this program and this scholarship will relieve me of some of the costs of this program and help me achieve my lifelong dream of opening up this pharmacy clinic for me, coming from a family who never had college education, it shows me that I could overcome even my own expectations and that I could overcome obstacles that I never thought I would overcome one day. Receiving a scholarship would allow me to avoid student loans and save some of the money that I earn from my job for future life changes such as buying a house. It would prove also not only to me, but to others that hard work does pay off and don't not to let anything come in the way of your calling. And receiving a scholarship would mean a lot to me. It would show me that someone recognizes my hard work, learning experiences, and that I've grown in my business knowledge throughout my involvement in Junior Achievement. This scholarship specifically is one that is very dear to my heart as I've grown so much with my involvement in Junior Achievement and I want to further unlock my potential with the organization's connections. Receiving this scholarship will help me make the most of my time out of at, at the University of Illinois without as much financial worry. This scholarship will be a step towards graduating debt-free and um, will, will allow me to have the freedom to participate in opportunities such as studying abroad. To me, winning a scholarship means that my hard work has, is paying off. You know, all the sleepless nights, all the uh, staying after school, all my extracurriculars are finally paying off. And it also means that I'm one step closer to contributing to the whole society and overall my community, uh, which is something really important to me. Receiving a scholarship means to me strength and support. Strength because just by thinking that I have received a scholarship, it will help me not to give up in my academic life. Support because it will support me with money to pay my college tuition and my college expenses. Regardless of where I am or where I will end up, I believe that um, the things that I have learned through JA and through the CTE business program at Whitney Young, uh, I will have the skills necessary to be successful going forward. Finally, winning a scholarship would not only let me fulfill my dreams, but allow me to encourage others to do the same as I educate the next young generation of children. I hope to be a living example of Junior Achievement's mission of inspiring and preparing young people to succeed because of the variety of experiences and lessons I've learned while attending, volunteering, and partnering up with the organization. I am excited for what the future holds for me and for you and for everybody else.